Hi, everybody. Good Sunday afternoon. Cooking over at Nana and, Pat, Nana and Papa's today. There's Papa in the background. He's uh, he's going to be the cooking man today. I'm going to be just sitting here relaxing. I, I don't know if you can tell or not, but my lupus is kind of acting up today. My cheeks are all red and I'm getting that lupus rash. So it's just going to be a good day for me to sit here and rest while, while Papa... Papa Gordon gets the cooking done. I see, Jackie, you are editing a video today. Hi, Vicki. Hello, Star Sun Bouquet. Let's see. Tonda M. You're making Swiss steak. All gratin potatoes and fresh green beans. Hi, Jenny Anderson. Much love to you too. So it's going to be just a relaxing day. Hey, Dandy. Good to see you, Dandy. Hi, Crystal Silverheart. Nice to see you. I hope everyone's having a good day. What are y'all up to? Hi, Lizzie. Hi, hi, Lizzie. I was just saying I'm having a little bit of lupus mess today. My cheeks are all red and a little got my lupus rash going, but um, I'm I'm okay. I just feel a little tired. Hi, Gib Giblet or Giblet of New Hampshire or NH. I'm guessing that's New Hampshire. I'm glad you're here with us, new sub. Hi, Denise C. Hi, everybody. Glad you're all here. You're doing some meal planning for the week, Jeannie? I was up really late watching movies, and really I haven't slept since yesterday. So that happens with me sometimes. Hi, Thing One. We are cooking Swiss steak, all gratin potatoes, and fresh green beans. Those good old cheesy potatoes. Yum, yum. Thank you, Lizzie. I'll be fine. I just need to rest and take it easy. So Gordon's going to be cooking today. And uh, I'll try to tell you what he's doing whenever he's, while he's doing it. I've got the camera turned on over there, but I can't turn the, the microphone on in both places or we'll get a bad echo. Can I bring you the recipe? Sure, if you want to, if you don't need it. Hi, buddy cat, my beautiful friend. You woke up in time for the live, yay. I love cheesy potatoes too. They're so good. Hi, Evie Scorpio. Just taking Boo out for a walk. Won't be gone long. No power last night due to storms. Torrential rain and cable blue. I'm doing okay. Baby, it's a it's a bad lupus day today, but it's okay. I'll be fine. You make meatloaf and garlic mashed potatoes, Lizzie. That sounds good. Yummy. Does Gordon have a single brother? No, he doesn't. His brothers are uh, both married. I got the best one of the bunch. His turn to make magic today. That's right, Dandy. Papa Gordon's cooking in the kitchen today. What are you doing there? Are you putting onions down for the Swiss steak? I think that's what he's doing. He just cut an onion and he's putting it down for the bottom of the pan for the Swiss steak. Are we ready? 
Yeah, you're cooking. Huh? You're on. You're cooking. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, like the, I cut the sliced lemons for lemon. onions. Onion like that because it holds the steak up off the bottom of the. Okay. Off the bottom of the pan so the sauce can get under it. And it won't stick so bad, hopefully. What's that? And hopefully it won't stick. Yeah, hopefully it won't stick. Yeah. Okay. Now I'm going to cut up the Swiss or the uh, sprout. I'll use round steak. Mm -hmm. I cut them up in pieces about the size of a pack of cigarettes. Thank you, Gib Giblet of NH. Um, so he cut the steak up. He says they're about the size of a pack of cigarettes. This is the size he cut them up to. But he put the onions down on the bottom to um, keep the uh, steak off the bottom and let the juices get underneath the steak. Hi, Kubi. Hi, Teresa Green. Hope everyone's having a good Sunday. Well, enjoy your walk with your pup, Evie. So he's got the steak down. Almost finished with the steak. Got a little bit more left. We like leftovers around here. We, we don't have any problem eating leftovers. So we usually try to have a little extra. But, you know, it's always nice to have leftovers. <laughs> What'd you forget to do? I've got covered flour. Oh, you got to cover the onions and flour? Yes. Uh-oh, he already missed a step. <laughs> He's got to put flour on top of the onions and then put the steak down. Um, when I talked about it in there, I thought I'd use either a fork or like a, this is like a, a spike tenderizer. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're tenderizing the meat? Yeah. Use a fork too. He's just using a little um, tenderizer on the on the meat and flouring the meat. I thought things were going too fast. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I saw the plate of flour and I was like, whoops. Looks like you're doing good. Tabasco sauce, Teresa. Hi, Sherry Shirley. Good to see you. Hello again, Tonda. You want to order Gordon to go? Love a man that can cook. I know. He's a good cook, too. That's why I married him. Not really. <laughs> but we can say that. <laughs> Willie. No, no, buddy. No, no, Willie, Willie, Willie. Well, hello. Hi, little kid. What are you doing? Molly came to say hello to me. Hi, Molly. Mama's not cooking today. I can hold you. Yes. You want to say hello? Molly has a treat in her mouth that she brought up here with her. She's got her treat. Say hi, everybody. I'm Miss Molly, and I always like to eat treats. Mm-hmm, even if it's on Mama's shirt. You want back down? Yeah. Okay. There you go, sister. Go eat your treat. Hi, Aurora. Good to see you. Hi, Catherine. Never chat, but watch all the time. Just wanted to say hi and enjoy my... Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. You always cook as if you owned a restaurant, huh, Sherry? That's the way Gordon cooks. And he makes big messes when he cooks, too. But he cleans them up, so that's okay. Yeah, my guy knows how to cook. Flour first. 
you need eggs, you add eggs. He's also a good housekeeper. Hi, pussy cat. I'm going to cut the rest of my onion up and just kind of lay the rings in there with it. Okay. He's cutting the onion to lay the uh, the rest of the onion rings, the, the rings of onion on top of the steak. If the rings are too big, they can also, you, once you do the bottom layer, you can do wedges. You could cut the onion in, in wedges or round or however you want to do it, just as long as you get the onions in there on top. Oh, Aurora, tell me me hello. I what? did hit the jackpot. I hit the jackpot big time. And we do make a pretty good team. You had an accident yesterday? A pelican took you out badly, Teresa? That's not good. Hi, Scott. Glad you could join us. Hi, Joanne Dallas. Good to see you. Good to see everybody. Hey, Davida. I'm not sure if anybody's coming on panel today or not. I put the number in the usual spot if anybody wants to call in. I don't know if I can do without Davida singing to me today. Mixing my tomato sauce and my diced tomatoes and my garlic. So now he's mixing his garlic, diced tomatoes, and tomato sauce together for the sauce for the Swiss steak. Oh, I'm glad you have insurance, Teresa. I'm glad you're okay. I thought I might ask a couple of trivia, qu trivia questions while he's cooking. Is anybody else cooking or just me? It's just you. No one else is even on panel today. Oh, good. So I don't have to worry about giving directions. <laughs> No, I'm doing it for you. Okay, you're going to get your iced coffee, Davida. Sounds good. I was going to ask some Thanksgiving questions. <coughs> Hopefully, you'll <coughs> Willie, Willie, no. Hopefully, you'll know the answers. Um, let's see. Let's ask this question. How much does the average Thanksgiving turkey weigh? Is it 15 pounds, 20 pounds, or 25 pounds? We'll see who gets it first. Oh, that came up quick. Bargain Shopper 85 got it right first. 15 pounds. Lizzie got it right also. Dandy. Saying hello, Ms. DeVita, babe. Hey, babe. Joanna Dallas, you got it right too. That was a pretty easy question to start off the day with. Does anybody know why California is notable um, during the Thanksgiving season? California is notable during Thanksgiving for what reason? Does anybody know? A 
hundred dollars for a turkey. That's a lot of money. You're right. Huh? Who said that? Could be. They eat the most turkeys. It says, on average, the state of California consumes the most turkey out of all the states. That's pretty good. Because Davida has a turkey farm bargain shopper. Yeah, that's pretty funny. Everybody's sending me neither love through Aurora. And now what are you doing, honey? Are you uh recutting the potatoes? Yeah, peeling right now. Peeling potatoes now. I already covered the uh steak with foil and set it off to the side here. Okay, he's already got the steak ready. You just set it off to the side. So you can adjust this for how many people got in the family. It makes it yeah. It's just you and me. Just, he was saying just, just, just to adjust the recipe for however many people you have in your family. And I know I put the uh, list of ingredients on my community page. And the... Um, does, does Gordon clean as he goes? Not really. I clean as I go when I cook, but he really doesn't. He cooks up. He cleans up afterwards. Um, but anyway, Gordon went in and he put all the directions in the under that on the community page. So that if you want to cook this at home, all the directions are there. Let's see if we can find another question. Are you using the mandolin slicer? You can I use the mandolin slicer. Oh, that's so careful. scary. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> hey. oh, Willie, Willie, Willie. Willie. <laughs> you tell me the story about Jones. <laughs> In the One year. <laughs> Willie. No. One year at Thanksgiving. <laughs> Willie. Willie. One year at Thanksgiving, my sister was making au gratin potatoes. And um, she was using the mandolin slicer, and she sliced off the tip of her finger. And so everyone was trying to see if the, we could find the tip of the finger in the au gratin potatoes after they were <laughs> cooked. She was teasing and saying that the, that the tip of her finger went into the potatoes, but it really didn't. So we were... We were giving her a hard time about giving us a little extra protein with her finger in the um, like mine without the finger, please. Yeah. <laughs> like ours without the finger, right. Let's see. I just got thrown out of my questions. I'm cooking. Trivia questions. Anyway, we didn't ever find her finger because I think she found it before she had to go to the emergency room and get her finger sewn up. We'll do some different questions here if I can find some. Oh, I think we may have already asked some of these questions. I'll try to get different ones. No extra fingertips today, Mr. Gordon. Be careful with that mandolin slicer. <clears throat> yes, I'm talking to you. <laughs> you don't have fingers? No fingers in the in the potatoes. Well, if I ever did, I would never tell you. Yes, it really did happen to my sister. She really did slice off the tip of her finger using the mandolin slicer. The 
Does anybody know what in cooking what you use a dredger for? Yeah, gib giblet or gi is it giblet or giblet? I don't know which. Your 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 brother cut his finger off and they brought it on ice and reattached it. Yep. Oh, good, Sherry. Shirley, your granddaughter's still there. It's going to be yummy. I know it is because Gordon's cooking. Rosea, you cut yourself on your thigh when you were young next to a scar from your hip surgery and used to tell everyone the surgeon slipped. They believed you. That's pretty good. It's called a... Um, what was that question? What a dredger is for in cooking a D-R-E-D-G-E-R, -E -E dredger. So as you can see, he's putting potatoes down, some flour on top of that. And um, yes, Rosia, it is flour related. It's to sprinkle flour or sugar. So he's put the potatoes down, put a layer of cheese down, flour, and then you, you just keep repeating it until you get as many potatoes in there that you want. And drenching is egg washing. I didn't know that. I helped to the know. So, hey, beautiful people. Hope it's okay. I shared your link and we send love to Mr. Gordon and many thanks. You gotta run, but be back. I take leftovers anytime. Okay. We, we will have leftovers, believe me. Good to see you. Honey, you did put some flour down in the bottom of that pan, didn't you? What? You did put some flour down in the bottom, didn't you? No, I sprayed it. Okay, yeah. you sprayed it. Yeah, the potatoes are going to be my favorite. Yes, please remember to hit the like button. Does anyone know this one? Stilton cheese is native to what country? It's S-T-I-L-T-O-N cheese is native to what country? Thank you, Giblet, Giblet. England, you're right, Jackie Burns. You win the prize, Jackie. I'll send you some potatoes. Well, since we're talking about other countries, we'll do another out of the country question from the US. Thanks, Dandy. Um, where'd it go? That's not it. There it is. Which country does the chorizo sausage originate from? C-H-O-R-I-Z-O, -O, sausage originate from. You need a home-cooked meal, Jackie? Shannon in Arizona, hi. You need some cooking tips and motivation. You eat peanut butter and jelly sandwiches almost every night and a protein shake for breakfast. And thing one, Spain is correct. Congratulations, you get a piece of steak. 
It is Spain. Bargain Shopper got it right. Jackie Burns got it right. Thing one. Does anybody want to do another, um, some other questions other than cooking? You don't like that stuff, Kubi? We've had a lot of people out sick lately in our group. Um, Dina Elizabeth needs some prayers. She's sick. On her second round of the C word, she got it again just as she got over it. So that's rough. Hi, Kathy from Texas. Okay, bargain shopper, get those cats fed. And Shannon, you live about 30 minutes from Mexico, and they make chorizo. I think I'm saying it right. And the McDonald's on the Mexican border serves chorizo, chorizo breakfast burritos. That sounds good. And I've never tried it, but it just sounds good. Hi, Mary Tackett. Good to see you. Yeah, buddy cat. We can do some other trivia questions. Looks like somebody just sent me some. I think that would be dandy sent me some. Do you guys, do you guys ever watch Seinfeld? Do you know anything about Seinfeld? Do you want to do some trivia questions about Seinfeld? You're coming along good there with the potatoes, babe. Uh. Thank you, Giblet. I said you're coming along good there with the potatoes. Yeah, yep. Mr. Gordon is hard of hearing, and recently. So far in favor. Recently, the cat knocked the bag off with Gordon's hearing aids in them off of the nightstand. So the, the, the cat and the puppy worked together. So the cat flipped the, the hearing aids off from the bag. And then Molly, we think, got the hearing aids out of the bag and destroyed them. So I have to kind of yell if for him to hear me. I apologize. I know. So we're going to have to get some new hearing aids for him. Well, I, like you don't enjoy yelling at I do enjoy yelling at you once in a while, <laughs> but not all the time. Let's see. Does anybody know what Newman did as a job on, on Seinfeld? What was Newman's job? Hi, Kim D. If I say hello to you twice, it's because I'm forgetful. If I don't say hi to you at all, it means I missed it. So I, I apologize. Mailman, postman, mailroom, yeah, mailman, postal. Mary Tackett got it first on my end. Oh, Kathy from Texas got it first. Mailman. That one was an easy one. A lot of you got that one right. Good job. Does anybody remember what Jerry's apartment number was? Anybody remember what Jerry's apartment number was? I did not remember this. I wasn't a big Seinfeld watcher. 
So I don't remember hardly anything at all. Nope, it's not 301. 5A. You got it right, Shannon in Arizona. Woohoo! Congratulations. My friend Lisa D was going to be here today, but she's going out to eat for her anniversary. So happy anniversary, Lisa D. Many, many more to come. You watched Friends Aurora? Me too. I think I watched I watched a lot of Friends. I could probably get a lot of Friends right. You want me to see if there's a Friends trivia game? Do we have a lot of Friends watchers here? Let me just tell Lisa happy anniversary. She says, I'm not cooking because we're going out for my anniversary. And um, my friend Carol Boyce is still in the hospital. If you guys could keep Carol in your prayers. She's going through a lot of health issues right now. So, and then Dina, Dina Elizabeth, Kubi, she's getting over the C word. And um, so she's doing better. Yeah, Rosea. We all met at that other place. Yeah, Shit's Creek is pretty funny. Hi, Lady Di. Let me tell Lisa everyone's telling her happy anniversary. Hi, Lisa. Everyone on the channel is telling you happy anniversary. Not sure if you're able to watch or not. Period. You guys have a good time. Period. Love you. Okay, I sent Lisa that message. Yeah, Carol's not, not, not having a good time right now of it. She's really pretty sick. Carol, if you're watching, hello. I love you. I'm not sure if you're watching or not. If you are, you could just shoot me a text and say hello. Thirty-nine years. Is that how long Lisa's been married? That's a long time. We've been married. It'll be 30 this year in November. Oh, here we go. Here comes some friends questions from Dandy. Cornelia is having some issues too. We also need to pray for Cornelia. I almost forgot. Sorry, Cornelia. But she's having some health issues as well. What? I was just talking about people who need prayers. Oh, I'm getting ready to put the, the milk in. Okay, he's got the cheese on top. That looks like a looks like Cornelia hamburgers. Should be about two thirds of the way up on the about two thirds of the way up on the pan for the milk. Good little size pan to use, of course. Mm hmm You don't want them to be too wet. Because you got all that cheese that's going to melt, too. Well, hi, Molly. You got a treat again? Hi, baby girl. You want Mama to hold your treat for you? You want to say hello to everyone? Yes, you say hello. Say, I'm getting big. I'm getting bigger. I'm still Mama's baby, though. Yes, I am. I'm still Mama's baby. Yes. Mm -hmm. She gets to running around here like crazy sometimes. She's so funny. She cracks me up. You want down? Put your treat back? Okay, get your treat. I'll put you back down again. Let's see if we can find some of these 
You took out, you lost a tooth, Teresa? Are you putting the potatoes in the oven? I put them on a baking sheet just to keep them from uh, messing up the oven, but yes. Okay, so he's putting the potatoes on a on a cookie sheet to keep it to, to keep them from leaking anything in the oven. And you got the meat in there too? Yep. What are you setting the oven on? 350. For how long? Hour. 350 for an hour? And you think they'll both be done? You do it for an hour, then you have to cover them and do another 15 minutes. Okay. So you then cook them. Then check them. So they're both covered. Yeah. And you cook them for an hour. Oh, wow, Teresa. You were rushed to the hospital and you were out cold. Yes, Carol Boyce is a sweetheart. Cornelia's, I don't think Cornelia's still in the hospital, but I'm not sure. I know she's doing some therapy. Like some physical therapy, occupational therapy. Does anyone know how many seasons on Friends that there was? How many seasons on Friends? I may have to have a piece of that cheese. You're a vet, Teresa? Ten seasons, you're right, Evie. And Shannon in Arizona. And Teresa. Your retired vet. I missed part of this conversation, Teresa. Are you a retired veteran from the military or a retired veterinarian? Okay, thing one. And you volunteer now? You're a veterinarian, okay. If I hadn't been a nurse, I would have probably liked to be a veterinarian. I really like love animals. I'm just not sure that I could do surgery on one though. Okay, you specialize in leg operations, animal surgeon. We're going to have to take our dog, Willie, to a, a doggy chiropractor tomorrow. He's um, He's got a problem with his spine, and um, hopefully they can get him lined back out. They didn't do any x-rays, though, so they'll probably have to do x-rays tomorrow. But we have stairs that go up to our bed, and he can't get up the stairs. He can come down the stairs, but he can't get up the stairs.
Does anybody remember on Friends what store Phoebe hated? Oh, look, he's cleaning the counter while he's cleaning, while he's cooking. He's actually cleaning up. You've had good luck with acupuncture for dogs. I don't know what he did to his back. Pottery Barn. You're right, Roxanne. Woohoo! You got it right. Pottery Barn. I know, Denise. It would be nice to clone Gordon. I know a lot of women that would be very happy. And the only other thing he's going to have to do going to do is cook the fresh green beans. I might need a heat bag for the dog. Do you think maybe uh, like a heating pad would work on his back? Like set on a low setting? Okay. Stop it. Leave alone. Leave Teresa, I think that we don't know for sure because he was a rescue dog, but I think he's about eight or nine. And he's a um, he, Willie, 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 come here. He's a uh, Schnauzer mix. That is scary, Rosia. And yes, heat will help. Well, I'll get my heating pad out for him and we'll try that. See if it'll help his back some. Rosia said, I found out when at 40, at 40 years old, was in a coma for four days when 19 years old, that I, she was given too much anesthesia because it woken up five days before in surgery and threatened the anesthesiologist. Threatened the, plus, they threatened the anesthesiologist that they wouldn't give enough. They would sue them. Right, and anesthesia will just sue if they didn't get enough anesthesia, I guess. Wow. I almost died. I joke they forgot to tell me when I was dying, so I forgot to die. I have been in and out of the hospitals a lot with many surgeries. Me too, Rosia. <laughs> me too. And I will definitely try the heat for Mr. Willie. How straight is his tail? Willie, come here. Come here, Willie. Come here, baby. Come here, Will. Willie. Come here, baby. I don't know how straight it is because he won't get off of it. He won't get out. He won't get off his tail and walk over here. We've been giving him some Remedil for the pain. Hi, Kayla Wolf. Hi, my crazy life. Is 
You're getting a giant schnauzer puppy in a few weeks. Just waiting for him to wean from his mama. Aw. Well, hi, Molly. Did I call you again? Molly says, hi, mama. I'll come. See, I got my little treat in my mouth. Looks like she's smoking, guys. She's a silly girl. Yes, she's a silly girl. Yes, you are. Hold back down. Okay. She just does these little drive-bys, has to come see her mama and get kisses. Really, Kim D. Your American Eskimo was all tight and could hardly walk. Three acupuncture treatments and she was back to normal. Maybe this chiropractor will be able to do acupuncture. You think? Hi, sweet pea. You're making southern fried chicken breasts? Oh, we need to do that one day. We need to do it in the uh, that cooker that uses less oil. What's it called? The air fryer? Hi, Sandy. Good to see you. Don't be a stranger. Oh, Kayla, I bet that poor puppy hurt. Getting it caught in the door so many times. Hi, Catherine Morrissey. Oh, yeah, sweet pea. Your husband wants those chicken fried in, a, in oil like his mama did. I think my mom used to use Crisco when she was frying chicken. I'm pretty sure. Anybody going to come up on panel today? Glad you came today, Sandy. Good to see you. Let's see if we have another question. Whoops. That's not the right one. Let's see. Joey played Dr. Draker Moray on which soap opera show? On Friends. Joey on Friends played Dr. Draker Moray on which soap opera show? Hi, Jelly Bean Nurse. Good to see you. You're going to be listening while you heat up your supper. Love to you, too. Hi, Lisa D. Everyone was telling you happy anniversary. You'll have to look back on the chat after it's all finished. <clears throat> How many years, Lisa D? Days of our lives. Evie Scorpio got it right.
39 years, Lisa. That's a lot of years. Congratulations. Cool. We'll wash the green beans and we'll trim them. You're going to wash, he's washing the green beans and then he's going to trim them yeah. again. Long or short for you. Um, either way, it's fine. He wants to know if I want the green beans cut long or cut them short. I'm good either way. You guys, while he's cutting the green beans, I've got to run to the little girl's room. I'll be right back. So I'm going to turn my camera off, and then you can watch him cut the green beans. See you in just a minute. My camera's turned off. You need to scoot down just a little bit to the right. Just what? Yeah, I can see you. Okay. How's it going? I put them on there to be steaming. Yeah. So they get your steam on the boil. What the hell? I like them boiled better. Do you? Yeah. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm back. I haven't seen Muppet yet this afternoon. Hi, Ren. Hi, Mary Beth. <sighs> Thank you, Lizzie. You want to do some more trivia from friends? Do you guys remember Phoebe's boyfriend, um, David? Do you remember what city David worked in? Hi, Mimi, if you're watching.
Oh, Davida was at her granddaughter's birthday party tomorrow or yesterday, and she's going to post some pictures maybe on her community post today or tomorrow. No, it wasn't New York. That's a good guess. Somewhere in Russia. It's not Moscow, but it does start with an M. Hi, Kristen. Good to see you. I'll give you a couple of them or another minute and then I'll tell you the answer if no one gets it. Hi, hey, Deb on the move. Rosia, I don't think Lisa D's still here. I think she came in and said hello and and then left. But Lisa D, if you're here, Rosia thinks that you might have her blocked. The name of the town where of the city where David worked was Minsk. M I N S K. Minsk. Do you, do you remember the, the guy's name that Tom Selleck played in Friends? Do you remember what his name was? He was an ophthalmologist. Oh, you're here, Lisa. Okay. Well, Rosia thinks you may have her blocked. Hi, Julia C. No Googling allowed. You guys don't want me to sing, Denise. I wish Davida would come up and sing. I miss hearing her voice today. She's a good singer. Oh, I know you're not trying to cause any problems, Rosia. It's just like somebody else has me blocked, and I don't. I think sometimes once somebody gets blocked, it's hard to get them unblocked. Yes, Mr. Handsome Tom Selleck, isn't he a tall drink of water to look at? And yeah, I talk that way in front of Gordon. It's okay. You can come sit down, honey, if you've got time to take a break. Okay. Tom Selleck's name in Friends was Richard. Oh, well, Lisa D., they want you to come on panel and sing. Your kitty cat song. Brushy brush. Who loves brushy brush? Oh, you saw her. Okay, you saw her now, Rosia. So you're not blocked. Okay, good. <laughs> I 
What are the fumes toxic on, Sandy? Yeah, I haven't heard brushy brush in a long time either. We have all kinds of special requests today. For Davida to come sing, Lisa D to come sing. I know, Jelly Bean Nurse, it's easy to block people accidentally. With a when you're using a cell phone, I've done it too. What you doing? What you doing? You're this is a true or false question. Um, oh, you want me to tell you a story? Um, does everybody know the story about how I met Gordon? Anybody doesn't know that story, I'll tell you the story of how I met Gordon. There I was on my big white horse. Uh -huh. <laughs> you just sit over there. And you don't, you're not allowed to tell the story. Okay, okay. So you haven't heard the story of how I met Gordon. Okay, I'll tell you that story. It was right after I got out of nursing school. I was in my early 20s. And I worked at a hospital doing chemo chemotherapy for cancer patients. And um, we used to get cancer patients in there for all kinds of different, you know, reasons. They were either in there for getting their chemo treatments or they were sick or, um, hey, Dina Elizabeth, you can't stay, but wanted to drop in and send love all around. Well, we're praying for you, Dina Elizabeth. I told them all that you're sick. We're praying for you and your husband. Um, anyway, around about January, I think it was, I admitted this patient from the surgery floor and his name was Bob, Bob. And, um, he, uh, was like one of my favorite patients that I ever had. I admitted him and did his first chemo, chemo treatment on him. And after that, ah! every month when he came in for his chemo treatments, I, I always took care of him. And so we, we really hit it off and I loved him, loved his family. And um, one day when I was taking care of him, I got sick at the hospital and I got sick on my shift and I ended up having to go to the emergency room. And they thought that um, I had appendicitis. So anyway, I was in the emergency room and all of a sudden here comes my patient, Bob, pushing his IV pole with his robe on and his ball cap on. And he comes back in the emergency room to check on me. I was like, how in the world did you get back here to see me? And he said, well, I told him that you're my patient and I was Dr. So-and-so and, -so and um, that I was coming to check on you, even though I was in the hospital. And I said, and they let you back here for that? And he said, yeah. I was like, oh my goodness. So I took care of him for several days several months and um one day he came in and i admitted him and he said so he said how's your love life going i said oh my goodness my love life is terrible i said i am just so sick and tired of guys don't care if i go out on any more dates anymore don't care if i ever get married i'm, I'm just done with men done with anybody no romance and Anyway, he said, you need to meet my son. I said, I've met all your sons. I've been taking care of you for months. I've met them all. Oh, no, you haven't met this one. This is the one that just moved back from California to Oklahoma. Oklahoma is where we live. And um, he's in the Navy. And I was like, yeah, yeah, whatever. Just teasing him. And uh, apparently he, as soon as I walked out of the room, he called Gordon and told Gordon that he needed to come to the hospital and meet me and not to go home, to come to the hospital in his uniform. So um, later on that evening, here comes this guy in this uniform, and I'm thinking, yep, that's probably him. I don't know for sure. But then I get called down to his room, to Bob's room, 
And yes, it was. So we met and, uh, and you know, the awkward, hello, hello. And he, uh, and I left the room. And then after Gordon left, Bob asked me for my phone number. So I gave it to him. I was like, okay. Well, it took him a couple of days to call me. So I didn't really think he was that interested. And, um, but he did call me and we went out to eat. And to what we had, <laughs> we, we went to Chili's and we both had salads because we acted like we didn't eat, you know, <laughs> it was that first date thing. So, um, he was telling me that he was going to take the kids to the state fair that weekend. And I handed around and handed around, but he never picked up on it. I had never been to the state fair before. So he never did pick up on that one, though. He was slow on the update. But um, he did call me and ask me out on a second date. And he took wanted to take me to the Navy Ball. So he took me to the Navy Ball and... Uh, and the rest is history. We got married, and it's almost been 30 years. Can I tell them about the witness? Oh, yeah. When, when we got married, we eloped. We went, out, we went to Arkansas and got married by a, a judge or justice of the peace. And our, uh, our witness was the judge's dog. And he sat in the chair just like he was a witness. He sat there on his rear end and... And uh, it was so cute. But that's how we met. We got married in November. And my father-in-law passed away in May. And um, I sure love that man. But he was very happy that we ended up together and, and that we got married. Oh, well, thank you, Mary Tackett. Thank you, Lisa D. We have a pretty good story. And he had three children that he had full custody of. Their mother lived in California, so they never really saw them. And uh, I had one, and I had custody of him. He did see his dad pretty often. But um, we um, thank you. So we had four kids all just all of a sudden. I had three more. He had one more, and uh, and we made it. We raised we raised those kids. So, I'm trying to think of any other stories that we have. I know we've got lots of stories after 30 years. I just don't know if I could tell any of them. <laughs> we talked about having more children. And um, we decided not to. Oh, here's Muppets. Decided not to. Hello. Oh, hey, Muppets. <coughs> Whoops. <coughs> Willie. They don't like me. Willie. <laughs> Willie, Willie, Willie. Thanks, you guys. That's our love story. I Thanks. love that story. Hey, chat. Thank you. Hi, Dee Dee. The be the Dee Dee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm crying over the story. It's so beautiful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> that was really pretty. Very pretty story. I was um that that could be like a Hallmark movie story. It could be. Here we go. I was 20, 26 when we got married, so that tells you how old I am now, Jelly Bean Nurse. I was 26, and that was my second marriage. Um I was married young the first time. I was very young when I got married the first time and didn't really know what I was doing. Uh-oh, Dee Dee fell off. Uh-oh, did she? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she did. Mm-hmm.
and with my grandchildren whenever they were born, at least with two of them when they were three, three of them when they were born, I was in the room with them. We have nine grandchildren, and um, well, there was three, four, four grandchildren I was in the room with. Five, yeah, four. Oh. And one of them I got to cut the cord. Oh. Because the daddy was a chicken and he couldn't do it. So I was like, I'll do it. I'll do it. So I got oh. to cut the cord on that one. And she's 22 now. Wow. Yeah. I tried a, a dating site um, when I met my husband. <laughs> you did? Um, yeah, but it was through um, a local radio station, actually. It wasn't like Match.com or anything like that. Uh-huh. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I that's, how our kids, that's how our kids met their spouses. Oh, really? On dating sites. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'd never done it before. It was the first time I ever did it. Yeah. One of them used eHarmony. And another one, she was in the military, so she met him on military chat. And they're divorced now. That didn't work out. Mm. But, uh, and then another one, I'm not sure what website they met on. So, Davidi, you have any uh, any kind of romantic story about how you met yours? No, I'm pretty boring. Um, <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. He was a blind date. Mm -hmm. And the first date we went on was um, we went to the Laker game in LA because the Lakers are real big in LA. Mm -hmm. And neither one of us liked basketball. Yeah. <laughs> we liked baseball. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. And then we went down. We didn't know where we were going. And we ended up in the VIP and all these basketball players were all around us. And I'm thinking, what the heck are we doing here? <laughs> So we <laughs> we left there, but anyway, no, it was no, uh, no. Um, uh, what am I gonna say? Like Romeo and Juliet or anything like that. Mm -hmm. But what I thought about you was Nana Patty. Yours was like, uh, um, you remember the movie Yours, Mine, and Ours with um, Lucille Ball and Henry Fonda? No. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, yep. it's a little bit different, but. I mean, he was in the service and she was a nurse and um, they had kids both, you know, I mean, well, anyway, kind of reminded me of that. And I love that movie. Love that movie. Mm -hmm. I didn't Your like son. the remake of it um, with uh, Steve Martin and I can't remember who the mother was. Honey, do you remember who played in yours, mine and ours? Not the original, but the remake. The one with the, um, who was the Steve man that played? Steve Martin. Steve Martin. The one with Steve Martin. Yours, mine, and ours? Yeah. And there must be three of them. Because there's a Henry there's, Fonda. There's a that's the one I like. <clears throat> Dennis Quaid, Henry Fonda, who else? And I've never seen one with Steve Martin. I've seen Cheaper yeah. by the Dozen with Steve Martin. Oh, Steve Martin, Cheaper by the Dozen. Oh, that's what I'm thinking of, I think. Mm hmm But I think it's a remake of that yeah i think so yeah but the the best one is lucille ball when she's wearing her eyelashes on her first date mm -hmm. and she loses hey. it in her drink <laughs> oh my jackie goodness burns. jackie burns is in the chat hi jackie yeah. jackie's doing some editing oh okay. i gotta do that later too i just saw her now because i just got here <laughs> yeah but I will put some pictures up. Jelly Bean wants to see them, and I'll put them in the community post. And Kristen, I have a picture for your aunt of Jeremy. Her aunt loves Jeremy. Oh, I think I love Jeremy too. <laughs> uh -huh. I think everybody loves Jeremy. When I get, oh, I'm going to go to his house in about a month, and I'm going to think I'm going to try to do a live a little bit there. Oh, fun. Yeah. Jeremy's always a fun time. Yeah, he is. He is fun. Uh huh. Thanks, Jelly Bean. You love Brian Keith, yeah. Hi, little Miss SDFU. How you doing? So great hey, to see everybody. 
Kristen, Joanne, hello. Hi, You're Karen. all done editing. Jackie's finished editing. She just needs to do voiceover. Oh, okay. I hate doing voiceovers. I wouldn't even know how to go about doing that. Oh, I just rather play music than to do a voice. I mean, I do do them, but. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Karen H says, Davida Jeremy is a real character. Oh, he is. He really, mm -hmm. he, and I have to admit, he really is exactly what you saw is what he is. He is a character. <laughs> <laughs> you never know what's going to come out of his mouth. Yeah. I well, know it's fun. It's a lot of fun. How's dinner going in, Patty? Um, it's in the oven. It has to cook for an hour covered. And then you take the cover off of everything and let it cook for about 15, 20 more minutes. Yep. Oh, yeah. Your Aunt Phyllis is watching right now, Kristen. Hi, Aunt Phyllis. Hi, Aunt Phyllis. I tell Jeremy, I've told him how much you like watching that video, and he always starts laughing. He thinks it's so cute. Hi, Sandy La. How are you doing, Sandy? Are you crafting? She's probably doing some kind of crafting. Sandy's always doing something. Yeah. Hi, Lizzie. Lisa D. Okay, you have to leave now. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Lisa D. Have fun. Love you, Lisa. Have a good day or night. I'm earlier than you guys. Have a good dinner. Enjoy your anniversary. Yes, Lizzie, she is a beautiful gem. Sandy says she's been very busy. Okay, I figured. You might have to sing Brushy Brush since Lisa didn't go. Oh, no, I would not ever, ever attempt to sing that one. No way, no that's way, Lisa's huh? gig. That's Lisa's gig. <laughs> We stayed up too late last night partying, you guys. <laughs> like all night late. long. You made a coffee bar and shelf using all the man using all the man tools. It's awesome. You made a coffee bar and shelf? Oh cool. How the heck That's did you do cool. that? I need one of wow. those. Yeah, I'm That's curious. Impressive. I'm about to go make some coffee. I made my iced coffee. Oh, you did? I have some in the fridge. I bought the bottled stuff, the Starbucks oh, stuff, because I can't have anything carbonated for four days. Oh, Even that's though right. I've kind of been disobeying a little bit. But... Really? Oh, no, that doesn't sound like you. <laughs> no. <laughs> this is the Muppets lost a tooth this week. She had to have a tooth pulled. Yeah. But she's supposed to be following the instructions, honey. She's not. Can you, can you get on to Molly? I'm not. Molly. Molly's in there bothering the other Chihuahua, Bitsy. Molly. Little mm -hmm. Miss said she keeps horses longer than she does men. <laughs> Sandy, you know, if you want to come on panel and show us the coffee bar, you're welcome to. I can send you the link if you want to come up. My mom lost her dad when both parents were 54, and I was 24. I know Joanne from Mom now how hard it is. Oh, sorry, Rosia. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. That's Aww. sad. Little Miss, you keep horses longer than you do men? Huh? Oh, Denise, I'm sorry. He walked away. He passed away nine years ago. Oh, gosh, that's awful. I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. I need to learn how to use man tools, Sandy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the cough does last for a while after you have COVID.
Sandy, do you want me to send you the link? Just tell me, I'll send it to you. Hi, souls. Denise's grandfather was a carpenter. My dad, a jack of all trades. I had my own hammer when I was a kid. Have down a lot of renovations. Wow. I'm impressed, Denise. Yeah. Hi, Evie. Hi, Evie. Yeah, Hi. it's still so new to you, Jackie. You yeah. And Muppets. I'm sorry, yeah. Jackie. I love you, Jackie. We've all had loss this past year. Yeah, and this it's past. not easy. I was just thinking about him last night. Oh, well, was, yeah, I get. I was working, <clears throat> working, and uh, I, I can work from home and I can work at the office. So I have <clears throat> monitors. I have monitors at home where I can sign on any time. Okay. Um, cause we're doing this project for work and I was working late last night and his urn and his cross, the cross and, um, everything is right next to that, my work desk. Mm. And I have a picture of him up there and I just looked and, you know, it's like, you just, you forget, you always, yeah. like, I always forget. And I look and I'm like, I cannot believe. Yeah. He's gone. You're really, yep. really not here, and he's just smiling in this picture, and I'm like, I, yeah, it's it's, mm -hmm. it's it's bizarre, isn't it? Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. feeling that you feel. Mm -hmm. Okay, Sandy, I'm sorry you don't feel good. That's a terrible blood pressure. Oh, I'm sorry, Sandy. Not me. Sandy, did you take something for your blood pressure? <clears throat> I hope so. If not, you need to be going to the emergency room, girl. That's too high. Yeah. I didn't see what it was, but or did she say 145 it was? 145 over 185. Oh, that is. Yeah, right. yeah 185 over 185. I'm sorry, Sandy. Jeez. That's not good. That's a bad blood pressure. <coughs> doing, said, Sandy said she'll, Kubi, I'll send a picture to Nana Patty. She can share it with you all. Okay. Yeah, I just don't know how she did that. I'm curious. Inquiring minds want to know. Mm hmm. Denise, you are my hero. She likes knocking down walls, drywalling, etc. I have too many injuries now, but I enjoyed those times. Darn, Denise, do you know how to put a door on? White beans, <laughs> yogurt. Sandy Gordon said that bananas will help lower your blood pressure. Oh, Lizzie, thank you, Lizzie. Thank you so much. Nectarines or peaches? Kiwi. Kiwi. But you probably need to go to the emergency room with it yeah. that high. Yeah. Wow. Sorry, Rosia. Everyone has a story, don't they? Mm-hmm. Oh, Rosia, I'm sorry. My she, husband. Oh, she got a history. He had a heart attack at Costco. No, she had the a heart attack. So sad. Kayla Wolf bought a fixer up and she wants to do it herself. Wow. <clears throat> Denise does know how to put a door on. <laughs> uh, she said she does know how to put a door on. She <laughs> would put it up for you to live close. Thank you. <laughs> what I need to do is pick up the phone and get somebody over here to put it up. But... I told you I had to oh. just go pick it, pick it up. I know I nope. haven't had any time. No, nope, they'll come put it in for you. Uh, Home Depot or Lowe's have people I do did, that. I looked online 
for doors mm -hmm. at Home Depot, and it didn't say anything as to whether or not that they would install it or not. Lowe's will for sure. They Lowe's yeah. will? Large. Okay, I'll go to yeah. Lowe's because they didn't, it doesn't seem like they offered it at Home Depot. Yeah, they will. I think, they, I think that they do because um, I'm pretty sure we bought our doggy door at Home Depot, didn't we? Yes. Then they we, came. Bought, we bought ours. The door came that way. Right, but we yeah. bought that door at Home Depot, yeah. At Home Depot and they put it in for us. They did? Mm-hmm. Okay, because I specifically Look. looked and it didn't say like where you, where it shows the price. Yeah. It it's just those pick up and store and delivery and it doesn't say anything about do you need it installed or. I like they charge, too, they charge a little bit for that, but it's yeah. worth it. I like Lowe's too. I have yeah, better luck at Lowe's. I like both personally. of them. As soon like as I'm done you. working 100 hours a week, mm -hmm. I'll look into it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Kayla Wolf says all her handymen keep not showing up. That's not good. Yeah, no. <clears throat> mm -mm. We don't have a Menards where we live. I don't either. We do. Oh, Kubi, you like Lowe's too? That's right. I don't know why I didn't think of Menards, but yeah, we have Menards. That's what I find too, Kayla. But boy, I'll tell you what, their lightweight spackle has gotten so doggone expensive. And I know it's because of all the fake bakers out there. I'll ship you like it went from <laughs> no, it went from 19. No, check it out. It went from eighteen dollars. Well, no, actually, seventeen something in the beginning, and now it's twenty nine dollars. Holy cow! Can you believe that? It's crazy. I can't. And I, the only thing I can say is it's the fake bakers. It's mm -hmm. supply and demand. And when there's supply and demand, they can jack the prices up. Is there something else you can use instead? No. 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 <laughs> oh, that's a big no. Am I in trouble now? <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell you how many people have watched my videos and they'll say, and I specifically always say lightweight speckle, lightweight speckle. It has to be lightweight speckle, It right? has to be speckle, At, period. No. It can't be nothing instead of. Lightweight. <laughs> lightweight. Yeah, so. but I mean, there's nothing else out there you could use instead of speckle no. altogether. <clears throat> mm -mm. And so they'll, they'll t send me messages or pictures and they'll go, I don't know what happened. It's cracking. I go, I'm just going to throw this out there. Did you use lightweight speckle? <laughs> <laughs> and they go, every time, every time. They oh, say no. I, but the regular speckles less expensive. I go, uh, and that's what you got. Because it doesn't work the same way. I don't know why, but it doesn't. It'll crack every time. Huh. And it's heavier anyway. It doesn't look like real like whipped cream or frosting or whatever you're using it for. So I'll say to, to them, go ahead and use the lightweight spackle and send me a picture. I'm and a lot of show. times they do, and it turned out. I'm gonna Who's try to show. Patty? I'm gonna try to show this picture here. Sandy's coffee bar. Oh my gosh! You see that? She Holy did that God. herself. Mm -hmm. Good job, Sandy. She Dang. put legs on it. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, for corn's sake. Did you build that shelf up there too, I guess? That's crazy. Mm-hmm. That's a good, good job. job Holy cow. I need to do that because I need, I have coffee is like my favorite thing in the whole world. That's a good job. <laughs> really good. I think you could get another career going, Sandy. Oh, that's me, Rosie. It's Davida. Oh, she did build the shelf, too. Hi, Rosia. That's crazy. That's really nice. Mm -hmm. it's very someday. nice. I'd like to have that, too, someday. It's all the you coffee just, I drink. Jeez. You could just have them build that when they redo your kitchen. <laughs> yeah. Good job, Sandy. That's really good. It is really good. 
I want to cut off the legs of my chair and make it a <laughs> <laughs> and make it a um, small <laughs> tool type. But I don't know where I'd find it. <laughs> I keep That's looking it. at it, thinking I want to make you a bar stool size. But I'd get myself all screwed up, so uh. I'll just wait until they make one like this chair. Because my craft table that I work at it upstairs is tall. So you can't sit because my chin would be at the level <laughs> of the desk. Oh, that's how I work right now because my chair is broken. Oh, my God. Do, do you guys know what I mean with office chair? Do you, yeah. Yes. Okay, you put it up high, right? And it goes down, down, <laughs> down. And then you have to jack it back up. And then about 10 minutes later... I know exactly so, what you mean, yeah. Oh, drives me crazy. Thanks for my comments, compliments on my shirt. Jelly bean nurse. <laughs> Evie goes, I was wondering what Davida was going to say. I want to cut off the legs of my... <laughs> <laughs> Davida wants Ooh. to cut off her legs. <laughs> <laughs> Joanne Dallas said, it feels so comfortable to be in chat again. Aww. I'm glad you're here, Joanne. Yeah, glad you're here, Joanne. Yes. You know, I helped my dad build an addition onto their house. You did? Oh, yeah. Anna Patty, come put my what dad. The, what's going on with you, chick? Get up there and start building. <laughs> I, I, know. I need a bar I stool. I I can I know. help her. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we built on a, a new kitchen, a laundry room, and a bathroom. Wow. And uh, that was quite a project. Yeah, my son is, um, he looked at a house that had the. Um, I know, right, Jelly Bean? Aluminum roofing. Because remember mm -hmm. when Carol had mentioned that to me? Mm -hmm. um, he really likes it. He wants me to get that. I like so, the, metal, the metal roofing. It's, um, yeah. I like the way it sounds when it rains on it. Yeah, if anybody has that, let me know. Because um, I need a my, new roof. My parents had that. I loved it. Denise built a window seat. I love window seats. I want, I don't know what they're called. Forgive me. The windows with the, um, like they're all individual squares. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. I know I, what you mean want french doors like that so bad they have those at Lowe's. i know but i have to, i'd have to get that all redone because oh i see i'd have to get a patio door or something put in i just need to go yeah. out and visit my Muppet, muppets and get a contractor out there yes just, oh i told you did i tell you that john's best friend he said a gen one general contractor to do mm -hmm. everything mm -hmm. is probably not the way to go, he said, because they do they charge up on everything. And I'm better off getting um, individual contractors for each thing. Does that sound right to you? No. No. <laughs> no. No, because it's, it's just so um, matter of fact, but just, yeah. you know. No. It, it's, it's, um, okay, you know, okay. it, may it may cost you a little bit more, but to have somebody in charge of the whole project yeah. is much easier than you being in charge of I the whole think, project. I'm thinking that too, but he's saying that they they upcharge when they when you hire one that does all, you know, for each thing. So I don't know. What you need to do is hire a contractor that does the jobs too. And, yeah. Um, but that he's way. saying it's more expensive that way. It would be cheaper to hire individual people to do each thing but to me that sounds like it would be more expensive i don't know because mm -hmm. each one of them is going to upcharge you yeah it's going to be more mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah yeah I'll yeah, don't get the chums, thumbs up or the chums, whichever way is better for you, chums, thumbs, whatever. Get a um, chum with thumbs, Davida. Mm -hmm. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Were we all up too late? I know I was I working. I think so. 
I was I working up all night. night. I didn't see, and I didn't see the rest of that movie. I got to where she went and put back on her, where she was uh, Miss Arizona, and she yeah. went to go help at the. I don't know. It was a not a halfway house, but wherever she went, and I fell, a, I fell asleep. It was a woman's house, like a women's uh, battered house or something. Oh, you know, shoot. But I, yeah, I'll have to watch it again because it, it was good, Dandy. By the way, I mean from what I saw, but I wanted to hit her husband. But other than that, it was. Hi, Teresa. Yeah. Hi, Teresa. I, need to take it out and uncover it. I don't see Teresa. Okay. She's We're there. Next. Now Gordon's at the point where he's taking it out of the oven and uncovering Ooh. it, and then he's going to put it back in the oven to let it finish. Ooh. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm still in the Wizard of Oz mode. I know. Oh, such a cute little party theme. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, it, I, I can't wait. I'm going to put it on my community post, guys, so you can see some of the pictures. My daughter did all of the decorating and made everything. I can't even, even the huge believe rainbow. it. I can't even believe it. I can't wait to I show I believe them. it, but I mean, it's just so beautiful. I just can't imagine yeah, the work that went into that. Would she start like three months ago? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> There's Teresa. Yeah, three months ago. Hi, Mary Beth. Hi, Mary Beth. I, I sound like I'm can a parrot. Can I show the rainbow picture? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can show them, Nana Patty. Okay. This is the rainbow that uh, your daughter made, right? Yeah. For the birthday that party table. Isn't that huge. crazy beautiful? It was That's huge. Gorgeous. Have you ever, she ever thought about party planning? That's what other people have asked, but she takes so long because she's so meticulous that. Look at that rainbow. Isn't that pretty? And she made all those flowers out of tissue paper, the roses. Mm -hmm. It was unbelievable. Looks like it's going to be another 20 minutes. About another 20 minutes before it's done? Okay. I mean, she thought of every little she thing. She did. She Everything. Did. Yeah, she really did. Do you want me to show the food? Yeah. Yeah. Here's the food. Lay out there. Because the Wizard of Oz was the theme. Mm-hmm. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And see the corn? She made that out of pirate booty and tissue paper, so because of the corn stalks in Kansas. And then mm -hmm. they printed out all the different pictures of the Wizard of Oz and sepia. And um, that was supposed to be before she went to Oz, you know, with the corn and all that. Uh -huh. Being in Kansas. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then we had, um, they got Chick-fil-A, so they got chicken nuggets because Everly loves chicken nuggets and fruit and salad. So that was where you got your food. And there's you some keep more showing those. And then a cake. Look at those cakes. Woo. Yep. And then the cupcakes and the little <laughs> baskets. She those made those. She the cupcakes. I can't them. even. It's. That's such a good job. And I kept thinking Dorothy was real. It was starting to drive me nuts because every time I'd walk yeah. by, I'd think it was somebody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, Everly looks so close to Dorothy. Yeah. It's amazing. And those cupcakes have the yellow brick road around them. Yep. Do you want me to show the picture of her and her outfit? Yeah. You can okay. show all of them. She is the most adorable little girl, you guys. <laughs> she just turned seven. You're going to melt. Everybody's going to melt. I'm not kidding. <laughs> Every Isn't time she I adorable. <laughs> Hi, Lisa she was so D's excited. Back. Hi, Lisa D. Hey, Lisa D. Yep. And then she had this the lion and the tin man behind her and the scarecrow. Yeah. Lisa D said she'll come in. Um go into it's in StreamYard. Um, you want me to send you the link, Lisa? Thanks, Jelly Bean. Thanks, everyone. Let me send Lisa the link. We have a beautiful family, Davida. You really do. Thank you. 
I appreciate that. <laughs> Are you going to come sing Brushy Brush, Lisa? Probably will. Oh, she said yes quickly. Brush. Thank you. Oh, quickly. Lisa, D, thanks. <laughs> I don't know if that link came through. Let me try this again, Lisa. Thanks, Nicole. She is a sweetie. Oh, yeah, I know, right, Carol? Because of the wonderful things she does. <laughs> Did she get everything she wanted to be done? Oh my gosh. She did. She was so excited. Oh. Do you got to go in. outside, Libby? Here's Lisa. Um, we're going to take her to eat. So hey, I have Lisa. to eat so she gets back. Oh, good. So I figured I'd come on. Okay, good. Are you going to hit us with brush I'm brush? watching all the pictures. <laughs> really? Unbelievable. Oh, thanks. So much fun. I saw some pictures, you know? Yeah. I just saw the rainbow made out of the flowers. Oh, my gosh. It was nuts. She's got a talent. She's yeah, she... Real talent. She really does. Let me show... Whoops. Whoops. See, it's her birthday today now, Davina. It's it's my daughter's Stacia, oh. her mommy's birthday. Oh. There's oh, mom and dad. Up. And who's so the other so Is that cute. uncle? Yep, those are the uncles. And they're getting up. Oh. They got up. I'm dying. I'm dying. <laughs> oh, I I'm missed not. it. Turn it and oh missed it. God. You missed the uncles? Yes. Okay, here we go. I don't want to miss the uncles. <laughs> I, miss the uncles. <laughs> I have a different picture. There's a picture of them with my daughter. Oh, I think I've got it. Let me get to it. Yeah, I've got it. Here it is. There they are. Aww. I love it. Such a yeah. pretty family. Thank you. My other son couldn't be there. His my grandson was having a golf tournament they, all weekend, so they were gone. Oh, okay. Okay, Lisa D. Good to see you, sister. Yeah, I figured Gary's not back yet. He just went because we're gonna take her out to eat, but the restaurant is like in this direction. Here. So I guess he figured, let me just leave and go get her, and then he would pick oh. me up because I was I wanted to get like the dishwasher emptied and. Because I don't want to do that when I get back. No, no. I was a little behind, so. Where are you going to eat? It's um, the place, the name, is, it's like a, a Japanese restaurant. Oh. It's called Aji. Oh. Yeah, and they have, like, really good, um, like, you know, sushi. I don't eat sushi, but they have, like, the, Cal the fancy California rolls. And, oh, I like that. Yeah. I've never had the, sushi. I want to try I, it, though. You know what? I'm not into the raw stuff. Yeah. Yeah. No. yeah. Mm -mm. I don't have much luck with this stuff, and I'm always afraid that like I'm gonna get like food poisoning or something. Cause like I would be the one to get it. <laughs> it would be me. Oh yeah. Aww. yeah. Me too. Yeah, I've so never it had it. That so. I get like hepatitis or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like if I tried it, that'd be I'd probably first time I tried it, I'd get sick or something. Yeah. I hate to be like that, but. And plus, I don't like the texture. I tried it. I don't like the texture of stuff that's raw. It's kind of rubbery. Oh. Yeah. My dad loves it. Loves well, some of it. Some of it's kind of flaky. And my flaky. nieces and my nephew love it. My kids don't eat it because my kids are much more picky. You no. Know? But um, they have good food there. And what's nice about it is... Um, they give you like these big booths to sit in and you're separated from people. I love oh, that. So now we don't feel we don't worry about taking her there. We uh -huh. feel like it's pretty safe. Oh that's uh -huh. good. Yeah. So I like that. Especially if you go on the earlier side. You know? It's, it's like in the forties. Remember how they'd have those real tall booths? I mean the backs yeah. of them. And especially on a Sunday night, it's not that crowded. Oh, that's good. Yeah. 
So mm -hmm. cool. Yeah. I, I, love, I just wonder. love that your daughter should go into party planning or something. She mm -hmm. really, really should. She has yeah. talent. That's what people she tell has her. Talent. Nice. I've never seen flowers that pretty. I mean, yeah, that was crazy. Yeah. It smells good, honey. I'm gonna have like a 80th birthday party. I want her to come do like a okay Muppets theme for me. She can hire okay, she can get hires easily for things like that. Easily. <laughs> and people, I mean, people would pay a lot of money for that. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Can you imagine how much you could charge for that rainbow? <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. A lot. You know what I got in the mood to do again? What? Um, Origami. Okay. We need to do You're that one it. class that you're wanting to do. I know. I can do it anytime you guys want. I mean, I could do it, you know, you pick a day. Okay. You, you think we should do it during the week or on a weekend? I think either one. Maybe the weekend is better. Yeah. Whenever's better for you. Yeah. Maybe next weekend. Maybe. <laughs> Yeah, I don't. Well, I work, but Friday I don't, or All Sunday right, so I don't. You're right. You work on Saturdays, right? Yeah. For another few <laughs> You're months. You're so excited. She sounds about that. <laughs> <laughs> but only for a few more months. Yay. <laughs> Thanks, Jelly Bean. Denise said, Lisa is very talented. Karen H., that would be great, Lisa D. I remember I was into all the boxes. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I still remember how to do them, I think. They're really fun. Really, really fun. Mary Tackett said, it's good to see you. Uh, do we do right? Said Lisa D. Thumbs up. Oh, thank you. I'm going to do, um, Nana Patty and I were talking about doing like um, a behavior university or behavior boot camp. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that would be another do good that. one. It's really, it's really interesting. It's sort of like um, why people do what they do. Basically. I would really be interested in yeah, that. Yeah, that's that would be interesting. So maybe I'll do it next next week. But should I? Maybe I should do it on Sunday. Yeah. Did you work with kids, Lisa? Is that not right there? now? I, I'm not working right now, but I always did. Yeah. For a long but does that time. what that that kind of entails? What you're talking about? Yes. I definitely wanna. We could, always, that. we could always do that instead of cooking next Sunday. Okay. I'll double you can, uh -huh. Let me see. Let me go downstairs and look on my phone, make sure I don't have anything that I don't know about. All right? Yeah. Okay. I was just putting some lotion on my hand. I have eczema on my hands, and if I don't put lotion, it, it makes me nuts. Uh, just so, it's so uncomfortable. All right, so let me go downstairs yeah. and check my phone. To make sure I don't have anything I don't remember about because that could happen. I have yeah. my ring on, Nana Patty, that you got me. Aww. I wear it every day. Lisa doesn't it. have a channel, yeah. Vicky. Oh, Lisa. I love it. Let me no, see. I wear, what it. I wear my cross every day. Every oh, how day. pretty. Isn't this beautiful? Oh, that's real pretty. It is pretty. Nana Patty bought me this. Oh, that's very pretty. You're so sweet, mm -hmm. Nana Patty. I wear it every day. Where is my dog? Libby. Oh no. I love it. That's I'm glad beautiful. you love it. Fit your purse every day. Chicken. <laughs> Here she comes. Every day. All right, I'm gonna go down and check my phone right okay. now. Let's make a plan. Okay. Okay. I okay. love it when you have a plan. The bunny's still sleeping under the bed. Your bunny, you sleeping? You go sleepy pie, bunny. Oh. Where's the bunny? Are you sleeping? When grandma gets home, you have your dinner, okay? <laughs> I love you it, have bunny. When grandma gets home, she will eat. She'll sleep okay, until about probably around seven. Can you walk on the leash? No. She'll sleep till around seven. Has he ever? Has he ever done tried leash walking with the bunny? Has she, she ever tried, tried it? But she um when she puts the little harness on her. She sort of crouches down on the ground and doesn't move. Oh. <laughs> Lots of dogs do that the first time. 
She's not a fan of being outside either. She's afraid of the outside. Oh. She's not accustomed to it. Let me get my. I want to get my charging thing for my for my watch. Oh yes, yeah, she did. Mm-hmm. I charge my my watch is in charge. You had a white one when you were a kid, Denise. Oh, I had a um, brown and white one. He's taking a while to go get her. And I named him Thumper. Usually he gets here. Oh, oh that's you know cute. What? Oh, he's back. Ours was Thumper. Right, I'm going to have to leave, but let me check really fast. If I remember back. right. What? Demita? Demita had a bunny and it was Thumper, I believe. Oh, really? I yeah, from um, Bambi. The next yeah. Sunday is the 28th. Who's? And it doesn't look like I have anything. Okay. It's August 28th. Yes. Yep. Okay, so we'll yep. do it. Should I do it the same time that we cook? Yeah. Okay. Or we can not cook and we can just do the class. Okay. You could alternate like, them. Do you like that time? Yeah. I yeah. think everyone does. Okay. Two o'clock on Sunday. What? Two o'clock my time on Sunday. Yes. Which is three your time, which is twelve three. my time. Mm hmm Okay, we'll do we that. We might next have Sunday. to do it more than one week. Okay. Maybe That's two fine. in a row. That's fine. All right. Mm hmm All right, I better go. Who wants brushy brush, brushy brush and a brushy brush? You want brushy brush. You love it so much. How's that? Oh, I could just fall asleep. Very good. <laughs> Yay. Right, Thanks, Lisa. Lisa. Yay. Thanks, Lisa. I love it. I love you guys a lot. Love you. Love you, too. All right. Love you, Bye -bye. Lisa. Bye, Lisa. Bye, Lisa. Bye. I don't know how to get out of this. You just oh, press the... Leave. Okay. Did you find it? Bye. 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 Have fun. Mm-hmm. Somebody told me I needed to drink some cold water. I think they're talking about my face. And my face just does this. It's my lupus, guys. Oh, yeah. That's why my face does this. It gets pink. Yeah, red. And red, and it feels kind of rashy. Well, you look beautiful, Nana Patty. Yeah. Thanks. Little rosy cheeks, so I got bags under my eyes. No, let's not go. That's, I know you had to beat his head enough. <laughs> she, she didn't want to hear oh, about, about me. <laughs> I was just talking to Daisha about that this morning. I said, I got to get an eye lift really bad. You don't. Oh, yes, I do. Believe me, I do. I most certainly do. Yes. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I do. I need a bag lift. What do they do? Suck them out? I don't know. I, I think they cut. I'm just telling everybody it's from my glasses. They made rings under my eyes. I'm in denial. And that's the way well, it's going to be. This, yeah. is a, this is called a Myler rash, guys. It's And it's common with lupus. And... Um, it just happens sometimes, and I think it's happening because I didn't sleep last night. Yeah. Uh, it can happen from for whatever reason. It really doesn't even have to have a reason. It just happens. Right. Yeah, I could use a total body lift. Oh, I would love one. one. I would love one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hi, Carol Clark. Good Hi, to Carol see Clark. you. Hey, Carol Clark. I yeah, I really want to get it now. done, Karen. I just got to get the money. But once I have it, I'm doing it. And someone said, you'll be bruised. I said, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah, jelly bean nurse. I get the heat intolerance, too. I'm not on any steroids right now, though. I don't know. I didn't notice, Nana Patty. You look beautiful before. Oh, thanks. I didn't put on any makeup today, and I've got that rash. And don't worry so, about it. Oh well. 
I didn't see it. I'll eat something and then I'll lay down and take a nap. Yeah. You need to take a nap. Mm-hmm. I took a nap yesterday, guys, and I slept forever. Yeah. I, didn't, I went to sleep. I didn't sleep. I didn't sleep the night before either, so I went to sleep yesterday about noon, and I didn't wake up until about 11, 11.30 last night. Yeah, you needed it. Mm-hmm. Hi, Ladybug Toes. I love that name. That's so cute. Oh, that. <laughs> that is cute. Hi, Ladybug Toes. Mm hmm Nana Patty, did you see Sandy's comment? Sandy's comment? My sleeping's crazy too, Denise. Please tell Carol Boyce she loves her. I will, Sandy. Yeah. I'll tell her. She'll tell her. She's not doing too good, Sandy. No, she's not. How long has she been in the hospital now? Uh, a week? Over a week. It's been about... It's been about a week. It's a week and a couple of days. Yeah. Thanks, Kayla. 100 and check. Woo-hoo, you go, girl. Wow. Thanks, guys. <laughs> 100 Yay. likes. Thank you very much, you guys. Yeah. This is really a lot of fun. I, I like Sundays. Yeah, Sundays are fun days. Sundays are fun days. Sundays and I usually Sundays. don't like Sundays at all because you know, you know, Sunday you spend the whole day getting ready for work the next day. Yes. Ugh. Sundays were my least favorite day when I work. Even worse than Monday. Monday, Monday. I'll, I'll make any songs. Monday, Monday. <laughs> Thanks for listening. And trust that day. Hey, Nanny. Huh? My switch thing is good. It's, it's out. Take me another 10 minutes. Okay. It takes you to switch thing. Woo! Even oh, the thing's out. He put it out to see it. Can you slide it back just a little bit? Oh. There. I'm, I'm going to highlight it. All right, Jerry, girl. Kayla said next time she'll do dishes. There's the Swiss steak. Oh, that looks good, Gordon. Pretty. Really good, Gordon. Might want to cover it, babe, so it'll stay warm. Yeah, that really does look good. I'll just make sure I saw it. Mm-hmm. Good old Gordon. Yeah. Oh, I know, Mary Tackett. I know. It's not good, Sandy. Yeah, hearts and prayers for Carol Boyce. Yes, yeah, seriously. If you don't mind, please. Yeah, she needs lots and lots of prayers. Hi, Star Sun Bonnet. Star Sun Bonnet. Not Star Sun. Star, Star Sun, Sun Bouquet. Bouquet. Oh, Lord, help me. <laughs> God, I'm asleep. <laughs> You're Hi, White Wonder. Thanks, Kayla. Um, you're making Swiss steak, right, Nana Patty? Yes. Swiss steak, I'll grind, I'll grind potatoes and fresh green beans. And I know who will want some green beans. Did you tell Dandy? <laughs> Thanks, Teresa. Dandy, yes, are you still in the chat? One green beans, no milk. Those eyebrows make you look like he's pissed off. <laughs> Really, you look bad, buddy. That boy seems like he's mad now. Mm-hmm. I need to fix your eyebrows. Anyone that has the prayer group sent put Carol's More so uh, name to a click. Yes. Thank thing. you, everyone. Oh. Nana Patty. Yeah. Did you tell Dandy what her mom said when you said I'll gratin potatoes last week? <laughs> no. I forgot what she said. All rotten potatoes. Right. She thought she said rotten potatoes. Yeah. Yeah. I love All that. Rotten. It was so rotten. cute. All rotten. Yeah. She's she is cute. I love her. 
Sandy, you want me to just show that to Jackie Burns? You want me to send it to her? Oh, you're welcome, my wonder. She said, I want to say thank you to everyone who prayed for my little cousin that was at the Uvalde school shooting. Of course, I wonder. Oh, she was so cute, Dandy. <laughs> I remember I laughed. And Kubi, is Kubi still there? Oh, okay, I'll show it here. Kubi dooby doo. Where are you? We got some work to do now. <laughs> <laughs> well, Sandy, she needs Sandy needs Law, her. I just sent you a message. She's pretty sick. Okay, Sandy wanted me to show this picture, so let me show it real quick here. Looks like another project she worked on. Isn't that the cutest thing? Up a little bit, then. Okay. Can you see it? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Isn't that adorable? That is so cute. Did you use a mop or is that material, Sandy? Oh my gosh. That's <laughs> that cute. That is so cute. Gordon, they said you're a keeper. Oh, thanks. What is that? Like a no? <laughs> yeah. Gordon, oh, thanks. What is that? <laughs> he yeah, said, oh, thanks. Out. He said, oh, thanks. And, uh, and then he How said, did you make that, that, Sandy? That's so cute. That is Swiss adorable. steak's really good. Rosia. It's a mop you untwisted. Is that the witch's hat, Sandy, that you used for the hat for the gnome? Right away, I thought a witch's hat. Maybe not. Thanks, Teresa Elvis, 2024. She wants to craft with us someday. I do too, Teresa. Yeah. I just don't have a place to do it right now. We will do that one day, and you can. You're welcome to join us. And I need to learn to craft something. You know, I gotta pick something I wanna try to do. Yeah, you just pick it, and you can do it. Cause I have faith in you. Thanks, Tita. <laughs> we, we could we could do some decoupage sometime, or. I said Anything. I made those Twinkie trees. I made a Twinkie. Yeah. I made many Twinkies out of clay once. That worked mm -hmm. out really well. That's perfect, Sandy. Perfecto. Perfecto mundo. Sunday, Monday, Monday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy, happy days. days. <laughs> Star Sun Bouquet said, Gordon, it looks delicious. Thank you for sharing your dinner prep. Well, sure. Jelly bean, I don't believe That's that. True. Anyone can craft. If they saw me, they know I like to cook. <laughs> yeah. You mm -hmm. never blue gun, Joanne. That's okay. You can diamond paint and not use a glue gun. You sure could. Here's another one of Sandy's crafts I'll show y'all. Hello. 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 Hello, gorgeous. Whoops, hold on. Kayla said I could make bottle cap magnets. That sounds different. Oh, it's adorable. That is adorable. Isn't that so cute? Oh, let me, I can't see. Let me see. Oh. Some leaves. Another gnome? Some leaves for his beard. Mm -hmm. like kind of mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. That is Wait, really so cute. cute. That's different, too. Mm -hmm. You're so good at that stuff, Sandy. Yes, that is adorable. I always decorate for fall. I don't know if I'm going to this year, but I usually do. You put some stuff up, even if it's just a few things that make you happy. Yeah. Teresa Elvis has a Cricut, a scan and cut, die cutting machine, etc. 
Oh, nice. She's ready. She's ready. Mm-hmm. Have you used your Cricut, Teresa? I've used mine a little bit, but I'm not very good at it. But I'd like to, whatever I craft, I'd like to sell if it's good enough. Uh-huh. Because sure. I have a little house. I couldn't keep everything I make, but that that would be nice. I would like to do that sometime. Oh, I'm sure. I don't doubt for a minute you wouldn't be able to. Hi, Honda. Anna Patty, you look pretty. Oh, thanks. Thank you. You're welcome. I can't wait to decorate for fall. Got new stuff from Hobby Lobby. You go, girl. Oh, that's a good idea, Kayla. Hot glue a small round magnet to a favorite bottle cap for the refrigerator. Fun okay. and useful. That's a good idea. That's a great idea, Kayla. I'd love to learn how to how to cricket better. So complicated. Well, I know. I'm hearing you there, lady. Lizzie loves to craft. Yes, I have. I love it. And cut cutting out stamped images. For Wow. Davina, I missed, did you say, if you started using your Cricut or you have no. no. Funny. No, I didn't want to, I swear. <laughs> I swear. No, I didn't. I know my old one very well, but my new one, I did finally get the my password or whatever you need to get into it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that was it. That was it. Oh, okay. Um, so, yes, I'm waiting, but I am determined this Christmas to get oh. things done. And I once I get will. it, I think I'll be fine. It's just getting it. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared, you guys. I'm scared, okay? It's, it's kind of intimidating. It sounds I'm intimidated. Like it yeah. I'm intimidated. I mean, I don't even have one because it sounds intimidating. Well, no. No, go ahead. Because John was like going to buy in 10 he years. Was, um, <laughs> Way back when um, Sandy was using the cricket, he had seen it. I had it on TV, you know. Mm -hmm. And he said, if you want one, get one. I'm like, I don't even know what I would do with it. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you'll get it. Denise is going to make a collage of, from flowers and leaves I pressed. Ooh, that'll be pretty. Especially fall leaves, they're what? so vibrant. Like lipstick, lipstick kind of? Chapstick or something? Well, sort of. Yeah, that's what I was going to do. Can I ask a really dumb question about no, the cricket? No, no question is dumb. Well, it, it, be, it, it might be, it might be dumb. Does the cricket have to be used on the cricket? Does it, can you use a cricket as a printer? As like a regular printer, too? Or no? You know what I mean? Don't, th no, I don't think so. so. I don't think so. Um, scan and cut, I think you can. Isn't that right? Someone that has a scan of it. A uh, scan of it. Oh, my Lord. <sighs> Anyone that has a scan and cut, can that print? I think it can, but I don't think the cricket prints. Yes, yeah, Sandy I, said no. It's not okay. A I just wondered, because I don't have a printer, an actual printer. When I print, like when I'm working from home and I print, so mm -hmm. I it prints at the office. Printers are very inexpensive but, now, Muppets. You can get yeah, some, I think, for like 30 bucks. I really need one for documents and stuff. But um, that's why I was wondering if it yeah. would do that too. Like the, I said, it was probably a dumb question. No, it's not dumb. Um, because I even wondered if maybe one came out. But I think does yeah, the, the scanner cut. The scanner cut, does, that prints out, I believe. And I was at Hobby Lobby yesterday, Davida. You were? And I went right past the cricket, cricket aisle and I didn't look to see if you were on You didn't? Really? Mary Tackett just gave one away. To what side? Oh. You don't need a printer for the cricket. Oh, so hi. Hi, April. April. Hi, April. Thank you, Star Sun. Oh, another good idea. Oversized scrunchies that are fun. Mary's been given a lot of work. Fun to make and sell. Yeah. Oh, that's a good idea, Kayla. Hey, Wait. April. If I had, if I didn't have big fat fingers, I'd like to try making jewelry, but I don't know if I could do that. 
don't have fat fingers. <laughs> <laughs> or those Three. bracelets, you know, the um, stretch bead bracelets. You could do that. Hi, Janie. Ja I always get her name. Janie. Janie. Hi, Janie. Wait, someone said something. Okay, Teresa said she, her Epson tank was $79, and I love it. Are you able to put the sublimation ink in that, Teresa, or is it just regular ink? <laughs> Rosia said, so true, Star. I'm in awe at how welcoming everyone has been since my return to lives. Aww. Mama Ames. Hi, Mama Ames. You just woke up from a nap. Speaking oh, of making nice. beautiful things, Mama mm -hmm. Ames is here. <laughs> yes, oh, Arabella's no. fifth birthday. <clears throat> I just tried the potatoes. They're not quite done yet. So. Oh, no. Okay. Probably about 20 or 30 more minutes, and they'll be good. Mr. Happy birthday, Arabella. Happy birthday to Happy you. Birthday. Happy, birthday Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Arabella. Happy birthday to you. Arabella, that's a cute name. Thanks, you guys, for all the likes. Mm -hmm. Thank the you. Thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, macrame. That sounds hard to me. Yeah, I'm a little intimidated by the old Mac. By the old Mac. <laughs> <laughs> I have to admit. Oh, did she hear me, April? Okay, good. They having a birthday party today? Are you having a birthday party, April? Whose birthday is it? I missed it. it Arabella's. Oh, okay. Oh, Happy birthday, fine. Arabella. Happy birthday to you. To you. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday, Arabella. Happy birthday to you. And many more. Party's next Saturday. Ah. I'll be there. <laughs> My mother-in-law made really pretty macrames. They're having cake today with their parents, but the party's next Saturday. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, Does went... she have a theme picked out? What's her theme? Everyone's so kind here. I always love it. Hi, Nicole Angel. Thank you, guys. We're just a bunch of kind people. And goofy. We're goofy, too. Goofy, laid oh, back. Oh, I love Hocus Pocus, too. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. Did you oh, say two or a snake also? Kubi, I mean Kubi, Muppets. Wait. You've got to watch the first one at least. Okay, so there is a two. That's the one's coming out brand new. Oh, September you, 30th. Well, I thought you said, you said, <laughs> you said, I love Hocus Pocus too. I thought you meant two, like also. Like, I also like Hocus Pocus. Muppets, save it. Okay, Listen. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, there I'm is not, the not first either. Hocus Pocus. I will okay. watch it, I promise. You need to I watch it. Watched. And then Hocus Pocus 2 is coming out September 30th. Okay, thank you. For oh, so, well, the, theme, the theme for her party is princesses and unicorns and Minnie Mouse. Oh, oh. how cute. How cute. Oh, you are going to be that for Halloween? Who are you going to be? Who's going to be that for Halloween? Kayla. Oh. Kayla Wolf. She's going to be what for Halloween? I didn't She's see. One of those sisters. I'm going to spell on you. And now you're mine. 
Ow, Libby, that was my face. I'll be back in just a minute, guys. You'll okay, carry I'll on. Back. I'll be back. They have it right back. I'm always wise for the time. Always use that. Wait, no. Yeah, it is. Libby, give me kisses. Give me kisses. I'm making hope it's called the stuff called the way. Nicole Angel said, hi, sweet lady at Nana Pata. Pata. Okay, that's it, you guys. That's it. I, I've screwed up too many words now. I got to sleep. <laughs> Nana Pata. <laughs> Nana Patty. Oh, yeah, you got a ring to it. Uh, you know, like, hello, mother. <laughs> hello, Pata. I am here at Camp Ganada. Nana Pata. <laughs> you are swella. <laughs> But I really have to take a little nap. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. We well lost it. It's okay. <laughs> oh, I'll, blame well, it. I'll blame it on my tooth extraction. Oh, that's right. Uh. <laughs> I forgot. I know. That's the thing, Denise. Hocus Pocus was filmed here in Massachusetts, at Salem, and that's why I love that movie. Oh, it was really. Oh, come on, you please. No. Prom do okay, wait. Promise me something. <laughs> Promise me this week you'll watch it at some point. Yes. Thank you. Even if I just watch it just while the scenery, on. just okay. the scenery is gorgeous, and I'm not kidding. And okay. you can tell it's filmed back east. You can you can just tell. I love it. I love I every will. minute of it. Is it on anybody know? Is it on Netflix or oh, I don't I can know. I can look for it. I can look for it. I have Prime too, so it's probably on there. Hocus Pocus. Dominocus. Oh. Take you on tour. Oh, when I get done, I will when I get done with my decorating. Hi, Bidey Cat. Kayla has the movie. We were talking about it last night at uh, Everly's party or yesterday at her party about Hocus Pocus. Oh, is that a, is it a comedy? Kind Are of. I mean, it's not scary. Mm -hmm. It's a Disney movie. Okay. But it's adult humor more or less but it it's just cute yeah, i mean I've heard, definitely heard of it i don't yeah, think i knew it was a disney movie though yeah disney sure cute hi tanda nana patty oh no, no, just pay tribute to your channel oh, oh thank you thank you thank you how to the know thank you very much mm-hmm Ladybug toes, love that. It's better than ET fingers. Although I did like ET. That was very nice. Star Sun said, "Oh gosh, I dabbled in small embroidery projects, Karen H. I like to finish projects in one night. LOL. I did a." lot of melting plastic design strips to shape. I can't recall the name of the craft. Ooh, that sounds cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, Hocus Pocus is on the Disney Channel, Debbie said. I don't have Debbie that. wins a life. Debbie yeah. wins at life. Yeah, Muppets, why don't you put um, Hell to the Nose link in there? Yeah. And I guess we should, we need to put DeVita's in there, Mama Ames in there. I was going to ask you. Oh, thanks. Oh, Nancy. Who else? I'll get the beta. Thank you, Nana Patty. Mm hmm. Are you done with your video, Jackie? Oh, I, I need, need to wine glasses for the Hocus Pocus. Need wine to focus. Oh my gosh, that's cute. Hocus Pocus need wine to focus. I'm going to make a fake baked cake um, having to do with Hocus Pocus. And um, I think a couple small cakes to put in my decor. Cool. A slow guy's getting in there. Hey, Mama. Hey, 
I just shared Davida's channel. Yes. Patty. You got Mama Ames? I'll get Jackie. Did you get, okay, Mama Ames got held to the no. Let's see. You find Jackie Burns. I think it'll be cute, Teresa. I'm still trying to figure it out in my head how I want to do it. Actually, I'm waiting for these stupid witch hats from Dollar Tree, and they haven't gotten them in yet at my Dollar Tree. Lizzie said Hocus Pocus is her favorite. I'm going to have to watch it. That's it. That's it. I gotta watch it. Is there anybody else we're missing? Let me think. Did body cat. Davida? I'll get body cat. Did you say Davida, Nana Patty? I did Davida. Um, trying to think. I got some pillows, not pillows, pillow covers, real cheap on Amazon that have to do with Hocus Pocus. They're really cute and good quality. I mean, for the money, it was only like, I think it was like $11, $12. Something on LTD. LTD. LTD commodities. Oh, no. Um, it says oh. you're the hocus to my pocus. <laughs> Oh, you're kidding. I think so. It's a. Uh, I can't. Re I should remember this. This is ridiculous. If it's a sign or a serving plate, I can't remember now what it is, but I just remember the saying. <laughs> oh, thank you, Teresa. I appreciate that. I really do. Thank you. Glad you're one of my fam. The fam bam. Hey, Sherry. No? Denise Renee, hi. Hi, Sherry. Neither, Denise. I wish I was watching it in Boston with you. Hi, Denise Renee. I was born and raised very close to Salem, Massachusetts. Lived next door to it as an adult. Left when 50 years, about 15 years ago. See Lori Cabot walking around the time. Wow. Uh, Carol Clark said you're going to be giving me a quiz, Davida, on Hocus Pocus. I will. I'm I'm Sherry did you really watch it? <laughs> I'm going to check the potatoes real quick. Okay. I know I just went on the burn. On over, you should be on the counter. I'm just looking at them. They're all right. It is a classic, Rosia. We are, Teresa. We are happy. We really are. Oh, yeah. Let me put surviving the storms in there, too. I forgot about them. Oh, Dorothy. Oh. I wonder how she's doing. Yes. Thanks. <clears throat> Definitely put her on it. You're an hour from Salem. See, my dad was in um, Cambridge. That's where all that side of the family was. We did trunk and treat in the in the desert, and I had a hat which that flew away from strong winds, so I just had a black dress. <laughs> oh. I just love the name, Ladybug Toes. That I know. So I think cute. that's cute. Oh, Pink Lady Luck. I need to share hers too. Yes. Surviving the storms in Pink Lady Luck. Mm -hmm. That's true, Mama Ames. That's a very true statement. We You're making a vinyl and wood sign for your daughter. Says witch, a witch loves her little monsters and one some handsome devil. How <laughs> cute! Thank you, Shari. You're a, a wonderful person, Shari. Did we forget anybody else, Nana Patty? I can't think. I don't think so. Let me look at my subscriber list just to make sure. Kubi might have fallen asleep.
Do you mind if I share one, Nana Patty? No, I don't mind. Oh, what about Kubi? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Kubi. I got do? it. Kubi dooby doo. Where are you? You got some work to do now. Oh, there she is. Mary wants Mary Tech wants to know if the potatoes are done. Not yet. Almost. Hi, Ugh. I love that name. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. <laughs> All right, I'm selfishly putting in my friend Stacy's channel because she's usually in here. Who oh, she uh, is? She's not now, but she is she does come in often. You have to tell me who so. she is so I can say hi. Who in panel lives in M Massachusetts, please? Rosia wants to know. I don't. None of us live in Massachusetts on the panel. Mm -hmm. Mama Ames, I subbed a few days ago and playing your videos a few times a week to help your watch hours. You go, Star Sun bon I want to say Bonnet. <laughs> Did I say I was going to go take a nap? What? Why didn't I just go do that? <laughs> oh, I can't. I have laundry to do. Ugh. Oh, I, I can't. So I can't. Do. When I get off here, I got to start ed um, finishing my video and then editing. Oh, yeah, you're editing. Is that hard? I heard that's hard. Oh, it's not hard. It's just time consuming. Oh. Very time consuming. I think I'll see you young ladies are probably around eight or nine, if that's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't have any work to do. I did it all last night till two in the morning. I have the pattern and material to make my costume, but need motivation. Motivation's the key here, Kayla. That's what I need. Oh, Joanne Dallas said she feels very emotional because for the last two years, she's had not had the friendships and love of the Rambling family, and I missed everyone. Oh. Well, you're here, John. Oh, we're glad you're here. You're here. This is the Patty Cakes family. <laughs> That's what we call it. We joke <laughs> around about it being the Patty Cakes. <laughs> mm -hmm. I know that I misspoke and was timed out on occasion. You won't get timed out here. Oh, oh listen to Kubi. Y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs> uh -huh. I love Kubi. Kubi, I love you. I love your face off. Huh? It's thundering it where Mary Tackett is. You'll find love here, oh. Jelly Bean said to Joanne. Yeah. It was Access thundering it here the other night really bad. It's raining here, but no thunder. Who no I hear laughter in the rain. Oh, I like that song. Is that that is Neil Sadaka. That's Neil Sadaka. Oh, yeah. I told you I have a problem. Okay, with I, like, I know, I know songs, but I That's don't right always here, know who sings them. You know? Yeah, I know. Me too. How do I we say? Uh, I mean, I do, do we go uh, for that person? I don't know how to say their name. U G H. Uh, uh. uh. Uh, Ugg. Uh, Ugg. <laughs> that reminds me of Ugg boots. Okay, Ugg. That's how mm -hmm. I feel most of the time. Ugh. <laughs> Mandy Hall. Hi, Mandy Hall. Hi, Mandy Hall. Hello, Mandy. Oh, man. Popping in to say hi. <laughs> you came and you oh, gave okay, without, without take. Ah. <laughs> oh. It's a good one. Yeah. Yes, it is. I'm just happy to be here with everyone. Yep. Me too. Yep. I hope Carol's watching. I hope so. We love Me you, too. Carol. If you're watching, we love if you. If you are watching, Carol, I love you. <clears throat> April, you're so funny. She told me to put another link in here that I will not ever put in here. So <laughs> you're just too funny, April. What she said. 
I missed it. No way, Bo, he's always got a sense of humor. <laughs> okay. Yes, we are all nice people. Holly. Uh -oh. Molly's, Molly's, Molly's bothering the dog again. Oh. Molly's being a bad girl. Molly. Mm -hmm. They said Molly, not Libby. You can sit down. Yeah, you're a good girl. Grace. Thanks, Starson. Oh, we're just gonna go start son, son, so I don't mess up the rest. There's Thank the potatoes. Let me Thank you. The fries oh. are done. Oh, those look good. I can't see them yet. Oh, there they are. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy, mm -hmm. those look good. Getting they hungry, Rita. Yeah, they look real good. They look real good. Mm-hmm. Are the green beans finished, too? I got love in my tongue. It's all finished? Oh. oh no, Nana Patty, you're gonna have a nice dinner and a nice nap after that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Rosea oh, said, Joanne, me. there are so many very loving and welcoming creators that will welcome you with very open arms. You are very loved and we want you to feel that way. Yes, we do. Touche, Rosea. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, Dandy. Oh, Dandy. They're, they're still shining bright. <laughs> Sandy sending Carol Boyce love. Thanks, Sandy. Three years ago, Carol Boyce was so sweet to me, such a loving person. I pray she recovered. So do we, Kayla. Mm -hmm. She was there for me with my husband, too. Okay, I'll, I'll just call you stars. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, you've seen me struggle, I take it. Okay, star, star it is. Thank you for cooking, Gordon. Looks really good. Looks really yep. good. I Thanks wish I for could cooking, taste. honey. Thank you for cooking. Oh, it looks good. Sure. Okay, so I guess that means so long, so long. Oh. <laughs> good to you and you and you and you and you. Bum ba da bum 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 ba da bum bum bum. I don't know what I'd do without you, and I'm not even kidding. Uh, I'm really serious. When I'm sad, I think about you and I laugh. I'm not kidding. Well, that makes that's ditto. Yeah, everyone's saying that looks delish. It does. Gordon. Careful, baby. Careful, babe. Mm hmm. Well, there goes. Just be careful there, Gordon. Molly's going to get a treat. Show your plate over here, you're going to show it over there. I don't know. It's better if you show it over there. They can oh, see it better. I thought he said shove it. Are you going to shove your plate over here? <laughs> you're going to shove it over there. <laughs> see, it's, it's called no sleep. Yeah. He's, he's going to show the plate off. Okay. Oh, that looks good. Oh, there's a delay that looks on my. Really good. It really does. I'm not kidding. I have a slight delay here. I can't see yet. I guess this is the part where we say a prayer and end our life. Oh, oh, that I looks so, so good, Gordon. Woohoo! Does look good. It smells good too. Mm. I have to take a Patty, picture of it. Sherry wants you. To Wants to know if you'll adopt her, please. Okay. I'll adopt anybody and everybody. All right, <laughs> let's go. Get your bags back. <laughs> well, I hope you have a good dinner and a patty. I think it will yeah. be. I wish everyone a, a wonderful week. And I'll be talking to you on my community posts on my dailies. 
stay safe and healthy. We love you. We appreciate you, every one of you. Yes, I mean it. Thank you for coming and all the likes. Appreciate it so much, you guys. And the company, just having a good time in your company. Yes, it's yeah. always fun, every time. Thank you. Thank you for coming. And um, I'm going to say a prayer. Okay. End date. Okay. And if you don't pray and don't want to join us, you don't have to. We'd love to have you, everybody that wants to be here for the prayer. So I'm going to pray now. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this meal that you made for us, that you provided the food. We thank you for Gordon and his strength and ability to cook. We pray for our friends who are sick, Dina, Elizabeth, Kubi, mm -hmm. Carol, Cornelia, and anyone else that I forgot. We pray for this country and for our world. There are so many needs in this country and throughout the world. We need leadership that's good. And um, just pray for our leaders in this country. And pray for people's hearts, their souls, their minds, their bodies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Love you guys. You're Love the best. you guys. Love you all. And uh, Muppets and, and um, DD, you don't have to leave yet, but okay. I'm going to go ahead and end the live. And. Uh, We'll see you guys later on. Hopefully this week I'll try to get on the live. Yeah. Yes. Thanks, you guys, for coming. It was a thank lot of fun. Thank you so much. We love you guys. It was. Thank you. Hold to the no. Thank you. Thank you. Mama Amy, Bye. Sandy, Jackie. Thank you, everybody. Dandy. Yes. Thank you, moderators. Thank you, Mods. You're the best. Love you mm -hmm. guys.